Hey guys, it's me Sarah. Welcome back to my channel. If you have no idea who I am, hi. My name is Sarah Marie and you should subscribe. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing something a little different. I'm going to be trying Daisy Keisha's, I think that's how you say her name, um, hourglass ab workout. And I'm going to be doing it for a whole week. So I'm going to film it for a whole week. And then I'm also going to be showing you guys what I also eat and I'll be showing you before and after results. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video. Please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And yeah, so welcome to day one. Let's get right into the video. There's a thunderstorm outside and he's so scared. Murphy just turned one two days ago. Everyone say happy birthday to my dog right now. Okay, so it's currently Monday, July 25th, and it's 3.30 in the afternoon, and I'll explain to you guys what I'm doing. So let's go. So I just wanted to show you guys a before of my body before I start doing the workouts. So here is a before. So I just show you guys what my body looks like before, and then obviously when the week is over, I'll show you guys the results after. But I'm currently in my mom's room because this is the biggest space that I have in my house that's quiet right now. So yeah, I also have some water because we have to stay hydrated. I have a feeling this is going to kill me. But I also did write it down in my notes because I watched the video yesterday and I like wrote down the workouts in my notes. So I'll just like go over like what I'm doing. Basically, I have to do all these workouts in like 40 seconds and then in between each workout, I take a 10 second break. Butterfly kicks, toe taps, scissor kicks, reverse crunches, jackknives, bicycle crunches, bicycle kicks, Russian twists, and then basic crunches. But I'm about to get started, so let's get right into it. I'm literally dripping sweat. That was hard. Not gonna lie, I know it's only my first day doing it. I'm dead, that was pretty hard. And I already feel sore already, like it's gonna be, I know it's gonna be hard these next few days. I'm gonna keep going, never give up. But I also wanted to share with you guys also what I've been eating. Um, this morning I had avocado toast for breakfast, like literally my favorite breakfast, I love avocado toast. And for lunch I had some the the mac and cheese cups the deluxe mac and cheese i think my main goal here is to like like i still want to eat what i want like i don't eat that terrible so i'm still gonna eat usually what i eat every day or whatever but i just wanted to let you guys know what i ate today so i will see you guys tomorrow with day two 
So later that night for dinner, I had some chicken nuggets and smiley face fries, and we also made some cookies, so I had some cookies. Hey guys, it is day two. It is Tuesday, July 26th, and it's 8 o'clock at night right now, and I'm about to do my workout, but I want to give you guys a little rundown of what I ate for breakfast and lunch and dinner, because I already ate dinner. Um, for breakfast, I had oatmeal with some raisins and granola, and I also had some coffee. And then for lunch, I had mac and cheese with some hash browns. I didn't take a picture, but that's what I had for lunch. And for dinner, I just had some leftover pasta, some spaghetti. It wasn't a lot. I didn't need a lot of it. But I've been drinking a lot of water, so yeah. I'm about to do my workout. So let's get into the workout. Oh my gosh, let me tell you something. I'm literally dripping sweat. Today was definitely a lot harder than yesterday. I'm literally exhausted, but today was a lot harder than yesterday, but I'm pretty sure my body's gonna, I look so bad right now. I'm pretty sure that my body's gonna, you know, get used to it and whatever. Yeah, day two is done. I'm gonna go take a shower and I will see you guys tomorrow with day three. Hello guys, welcome to day three. It is July 27th, Wednesday, and it's 11.45 in the morning, and I'm about to do my workout, so let's go. I'm gonna be real honest, I am not feeling this today. My body is like over it, but I'm gonna keep going. So I just finished the workout, as you could tell by my messy hair. I'm just gonna let you guys know what I ate for breakfast today. I had some cereal. I had some Life cereal, the cinnamon one. I had some orange juice. That's all I had today, because it's only the morning. Day three is done. I will see you guys tomorrow with day four. Hello guys, it is day four. It is July 28th, it is Thursday, and it's actually 10 p.m. right now. I was so busy all day, I literally had no time to do it. But now I have the time to do my workout, so we're just gonna get right into it because I'm so tired and I just wanna go to bed, so let's just get this over with. Sorry, the air conditioning is on because it's really hot in here. I know I'm wearing the same shirt as yesterday. Do not judge me. You have no right to judge me. Let's just get into it. Okay, so I just finished doing the workout and um, I'm tired. I'm very tired. Today was definitely a lot easier than the other days. Like, I feel like I'm not as tired after. Like, I feel like my body's getting used to it now. I just want to let you guys know that even though I'm not filming the entire workout, I am doing it. I promise you I'm doing the entire workout. I just want to give you guys a little rundown of what I ate today. Breakfast, I had the same thing I had yesterday, the cereal with... Um, but I had coffee instead of orange juice. Um, then for lunch, I had a turkey bacon sandwich from Starbucks and like a strawberry refresher from Starbucks. For dinner, I had pizza. I had like literally one slice of pizza and I'm pretty sure that's all I ate today. So I will see you guys tomorrow with day five. We're almost there guys, we are almost there. It is Friday, July 29th, and it's 2.40 p.m. right now, and I just finished doing my workout, and it is getting a lot easier, I will be honest. I feel a big difference, but I feel like stronger, but I just want to show you guys, I'm about to make a smoothie, and it has kale in it, and I'm not too thrilled about it. I saw somebody on TikTok make a smoothie with like, you know, 
kale in it and I found this in ShopRite and I thought I was like, okay. It has strawberries, bananas, blueberries, and kale. And I mean, it smells pretty good. I'm gonna make the smoothie and I'm gonna let you guys know how it is. So I'll be back. Okay, so I just finished making it. I accidentally think I made a little too much. We're gonna do a little taste test, I'm a little scared. I'm definitely not gonna drink all of this, but I'm scared. not horrible but it's not great it's okay it's okay you really I don't really even taste the kale to be honest but I would give it like maybe a six out of ten all right so that is the end of day five I will see you guys tomorrow with day six okay don't mind how I look right now I literally just woke up but I'm going to do my workout now it is day seven it is July 31st and it's the last day but you're probably wondering sarah why didn't you film day six um my camera decided to be stupid and die while i was doing the workout and i didn't feel like stopping but i did do the workout yesterday i promise i did the workout all these seven days i promise you but yeah we're gonna do the workout for the last time after of my body after doing the workout for seven days okay guys so I just finished my workout and that is the end of the video oh so thank you for sticking to the end if you did so my overall opinion on this workout is that I think it's very worth it I mean it's only an eight minute workout it only takes eight minutes out of your day and the results I definitely see different a difference in my body so you know, it's only eight minutes, like eight minutes out of your day to do it. It's, it really helps and I think I'm gonna keep doing it. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.